This is a new G-Code holster, uh, which I really like. Uh, reason being, I like that it's a drop leg and it's not so low on my leg that I can't, you know, reach down and get it. Even with the Blackhawk that I had, the Serpa 3, it was still kind of low, even though I had it cinched up as far as I could get it on my thigh. Uh, and you know, one of the other good parts is if, if you buy one of these style holsters, is you get just a regular holster and you can order the cow for the light depending on what light you have uh, most drop legs the safari land you can buy safari land holsters and they uh, are set for spit you know certain lights and the blackhawk is only set for their light but this typical holster here is you can any light configuration you just unbolt this and you order whatever cow you want. For instance, say you're running this uh, Streamlight TLR1 and you want to go to a Surefire, just get on their website and order the cow for like 25 bucks and you have the cow for any type of light configuration that you want. Uh, another good thing is the, the attachment system. You can just ta take on and off and you can run this can order their system and run any, any holster on it pretty much and uh, you can take run this on a, on a belt high on your belt order a different system for uh, you know your belt configuration whatever you want to run I order this uh, mainly for when I'm wearing my plate carrier out of the way it's out of the way and it's not so far down on my leg that I can't really use it I mean uh, three bolts on each side with the Allen wrench, you know, jerk this thing off and put it on. Uh, I'm gonna teach a firearms class this weekend, probably wear it and uh, have another video review on how it wears and stuff, and do some shooting from the the, the holster also. Check them out, G Code holsters.